Hi. I just went upstairs to get this meat, animal meat, uh, that was cooked last night, by, or today, yesterday, tomorrow's today. Um, I got this meat, and, um, because I need to eat, and, um, Um, I saw, my mom bought me a birthday cake, and I saw that it cost $46. I'm, I'm not the only person who ate the cake. <laughs> it's a really good cake. Everybody in the house had some cake. Everybody was really happy. My mom's birthday is almost exactly a month after mine. And I just thought I'd make this video to say to the world, if you're hungry, If you're hungry and there is food, you should eat the food. If your body is telling you, I need to listen to five more songs, or I need to finish, I need to write two more paragraphs on my essay before I can eat. Right now my body is telling me like, it's uh... 3.26 a.m. And it's like, what are you doing, guy? You gotta, you gotta go to sleep. People aren't awake at this time. And then, then my body tells me, drink lots of Coca-Cola and coffee. And then go to your volunteering job and be a wreck. And then you'll have, and then you'll get a real job, and then you can make money. And all those music songs that you like, all those TV screens and computers, and the meat. You'll have really earned it, because it's legitimate. Because... Disability is illegitimate. It's one more day till I'm 32. And I live at home. I have people who love me. And, uh... The government gives me money. Because, for example... Uh, about two hours ago... It was lying in bed trying to sleep and you know like people people ask you to like I was hearing voices and people ask you um, like prove prove that you actually hear voices prove you're not just being like this this guy who's like oh look at me I'm so crazy well, maybe I mean, like, look at me so crazy because I crazy need help. You understand that? Hearing voices. And I have a doctor's appointment on my birthday. Or we're going to talk about my mental health on my birthday. And I, my medication might be adjusted on my birthday. Then I have uh, guitar lessons, which like, sure, I, I, I do want to do guitar lessons. I haven't been home by myself like I was when I was drinking alcohol um, in a very long time. Like, just the whole day, whatever I wanted, 
I drink some coffee in the morning, listen to the radio, go buy some beer, feel the shame, the shame of buying beer with money the government gives me because, because I'm disabled. And by the way, <coughs> that eight dollars I was spending on beer per day, uh, without the um, without having that eight dollars uh, of beer, I'm now on four different kinds of medication. Let me see here. So they usually told the price somewhere. This is so sad. Well, that was a good pork. I wouldn't be surprised if that cost a bunch of money that I can't afford by myself. You know, I don't care. I don't really care. So there's that. I think this is like 10 or 12 bucks uh, for a week. Um, I could have sworn they had the price on here. Anyways, it's not that important. So I, if I was a doctor and there was some, someone who was mentally ill and he was getting money for the government for being mentally ill because we, we, we as Canadians care about society, we care about each other, and we, we won't let each other suffer. However, there's only so much we can give, like, to a person. That's kind of messed up. I don't have enough money to live by myself. And I think even if I quit cigarettes, I couldn't do it. it it's, theoretically, it would be rent and food, and that's it. But you need more. Um, and clothes, clothes. Jesus. So if I were a doctor, I'd be like, oh gee, this basketball player needs a new kidney. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, um, sorry. You can't see my face right now. So that's why I need a job. Hello. And I have a good life, but I just worry about these things.